Chapter 5 Natural Vegetation and Wild Life Introduction Have you observed the types of trees, bushes, grasses and birds in the fields and parks in and around your school? Are they similar or there are variations? India being a vast country, you can imagine the type of bioforms available throughout the country. Our country India is one of the 12 mega biodiversity countries of the world. With about 47,000 plant species, India occupies 10th place in the world and fourth in Asia in plant diversity. There are about 15,000 flowering plants in India which account for 6% in the world's total number of flowering plants. The country has many non-flowering plants such as ferns, algae and fungi. India also has 89,000 species of animals as well as rich variety of fish in its fresh and marine waters. अगर आप अपने सिलेबस के सारे चैप्टर्स इस फॉर्मेट में देखना चाहते हैं, तो हमें डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए गए नंबर पर कॉल करें। Virgin vegetation. Natural vegetation refers to a plant community which has grown naturally without human aid and has been left undisturbed by humans for a long time. This is termed as a virgin vegetation. Thus, cultivated crops and fruits, orchards, form a part of vegetation but not natural vegetation. The term flora is used to denote plants of a particular region or period. Similarly, the species of animals are referred to as fauna. This huge diversity in flora and fauna kingdom is due to the following factors. Land Land affects the natural vegetation directly and indirectly. Do you expect the same type of vegetation in mountainous, plateau and plain areas or in dry and wet regions? The nature of land influences the type of vegetation. The fertile level is generally devoted to agriculture. The undulating and rough terrains are areas where grassland and woodlands develop and give shelter to a variety of wildlife. अगर आप अपने सिलेबस के सारे चैप्टर्स इस फॉर्मेट में देखना चाहते हैं, तो हमें डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए गए नंबर पर कॉल करें। Soil the soils also vary over space. Different types of soils provide bases for different types of vegetation. The sandy soils of the desert support cactus and thorny bushes, while wet, marshy, deltaic soils support mangroves and deltaic vegetation. The hill slopes with some depth of soil have conical trees. Climate Temperature The character and extent of vegetation are mainly determined by temperature along with humidity in the air, precipitation, and soil. 
on the slopes of the Himalayas and the hills of the peninsula, above the height of 915 meters, the fall in the temperature affects the types of vegetation and its growth and changes it from tropical to subtropical, temperate and alpine vegetation. Let's have a look at this table showing temperate characteristics of the vegetation zones. In the vegetation zone, which is tropical, the mean annual average temperature in degrees Celsius is above 24 degrees Celsius and the mean temperature in January is above 18 degrees Celsius. There is no frost. In the subtropical zone, the mean annual temperature in degrees Celsius is 17 to 24 degrees and the mean temperature in January in degrees Celsius is 10 to 18 degrees. Frost is rare over here. In the temperate zones, the mean annual average temperature in degrees Celsius is 7 to 17 degrees Celsius. The mean temperature in January is minus 1 degree Celsius to minus 10 degree Celsius. There is frost and some snow. In the alpine zones, the mean annual temperature is below 7 degree Celsius and the mean temperature in January is below minus 1 degree Celsius. There is snow over here. Photo period or sunlight. The variation in duration of sunlight at different places is due to the difference in latitude, altitude, season and duration of the day. Due to longer duration of sunlight, trees grow faster in summers. अगर आप अपने सिलेबस के सारे चैप्टर्स इस फॉर्मेट में देखना चाहते हैं तो हमें डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिए गए नंबर पर कॉल करें ऐसे ही और एजुकेशनल वीडियोस देखने के लिए हमारे चैनल होम रिवाइज को सब्सक्राइब करें